Hey, Sean Jantz here, and I'm working on a live trade here on the NASDAQ 100. And this entire concept of this trade uh, that I'm, that I'm going to try and get, I, hopefully I can get filled. I'm trying to sell 68.57 right at the money here. I need just a little bit more and I can get filled here. But what I'm, this whole video is all about simply trading price action. That's all this video is going to be about. No indicators, no nothing, trading price action action and keeping trading so freaking simple uh, that anybody can do this. So I'm trying to get filled on 68.57 hourly binary at right at 50 bucks. So I'm really, it's currently at 46, 47. I'm really close to getting filled here. Right out the money, 50-50 uh, trade, max loss is built in. And let's take you through the process of this trade though. So first thing we need to do is we need to go to the four hour chart, which is what I call the bird's eye view. Okay, uh, four hour chart. Are we overbought, oversold, or at equilibrium? Okay, so we gotta get our bias. Do we wanna be buying, selling, right? And so, I mean, this is like slap you in the face, right? Obviously, we're extremely overbought. You can see the awesome, awesome supply right here uh, about uh, roughly three weeks ago. So that is fantastic, fantastic supply. Look at all that supply that rushed in. So you wanna be trading where bears have proven uh, to sell this chart, so I love this. And then you can see just how insanely overbought we are, right? So now, hold on, we're moving lower. Let's see if I got filled. Uh, so the volatility is pretty high, so that's why I'm will, I want to pay 50 bucks. I just need some little bit of volatility, and I can get filled here. Uh, but now we move to the 15-minute chart. Check this out. We're just trading price action. We're keeping this so crazy simple. So notice, let me grab my pin here that we've had some really nice short-term supply rush this market right here. Uh, London session supply, morning uh, open supply, and then you'll notice how now we're back. And so not only do I have monthly supply, and not only are we extremely overbought, I'm, in, I'm coming in at a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful uh, lower high right here, right? So we got supply, supply, down, and then now we're retracing a uh, nice little lower high. So I'm trying to sell right here on that short-term supply, 68.57, hourly binary right at the money, and uh, I'm getting closer and closer to getting filled. Come on, I, may, I want this trade really, really bad, so I may move this because I believe that this is just a bang out winner. Um, let, let's do 47. I want this bad. See if I can get filled. Come on, I'm, I'm okay with 44, honestly. Uh, I want this. 45, come on, get me filled. I may add more contracts too. In almost all my live trading videos, I only do one contract just to show you uh, just is more about the concepts. You can make much, you can literally make as much money as you possibly want. But I know most people, you need to stay small, trade often. So come on, I'm so close to getting filled. And if I can start at one contract at 45, I may add some more because I love this. I'm honestly also looking at some dailies up here and trying to sell. Uh, I may I may try and sell some dailies up above that plus 0.5 if I can. See if I got filled. Come on, two more dollars, I get filled. And so you always want to put your order out there. Uh, and so there I am, I'm in. So there's my trade, I'm in at 45. And so let's go back to this chart. And so I'm in at the uh, 68.57. Let's go ahead and draw that. And you'll notice how there's no indicators here. I'm keeping this so crazy simple. I'm just selling. <laughs> you think about this, I'm just selling as high as I possibly can with good supply to the left. I'm timing my entry as perfectly as I possibly can. You'll notice how we had supply, supply, retrace, supply, right? So I'm timing my entry. I'm staying as close at the money as I can, okay? Uh, I'm using that massively oversold, overbought four-hour chart. Um, I'm staying as close at the money as I possibly can. Uh, I'm, gonna de I'm definitely going to take profits on this because of the massive volatility in these indices. I'm absolutely going to take profit on this early. So I may try and TP. Uh, around 12 so TP around 10 or 12 so 45 minus 10 would be a $35 profit so you can already see I'm green so I'm gonna pause this I got an hour and 20 minutes to get some nice bears flooding this market which I don't know why they wouldn't they've already proven themselves that they like this zone and so I'm gonna pause this and we'll come back quick update here um, I'm sitting 
in Q, NASDAQ sitting right at my strike, so I'm at the 6857. Uh, you can see all of the supply that I have here to the left, and so I feel very, very confident in this trade. I sell 45 minutes. <clears throat> You can see here, uh, there's two o'clock. I still have 45 minutes to get some nice uh, bears come into this market, take you to my Natix account here. And so I sold at 45, I got my TP order ready to go at 10, so it'd be a $35 profit before fees. And so all I need to do is stay patient. Uh, we're sitting at great supply. Should be a bang out winner. I just gotta let the, I gotta let the bias play out. It, so the negative here is that it is lunchtime. It's about one o'clock Eastern. And so that's kind of the negative. You'll notice how we had quite a bit of movement here, and now we're in lunchtime doldrums. So that's the negative uh, about trading around. You know, I mean, you can clearly see, right? See all of this volume, and then it just completely dies. And so that's fine, whatever. Um, I just need to stay below that blue line, and I make money. And honest, honestly, I just need to get a little bit of a... I mean, if I can probably get this chart to come back to VA low, uh, that'll probably be enough to, to go ahead and take me out. So, uh, pause this again. We'll come back. I got about 40 minutes left. We're getting a flood of weakness uh, coming in. And so you can see, I got some nice profit here. And I'm, again, I'm not trying to brag, but it's like, of course, we're getting a flood of weakness. This isn't that hard. Massively overbought. Great supply to the left. I mean, this is just beautiful. I was so close to adding more contracts, and I didn't do it. And uh, so I got my TP order in here at 10, you know, with 34 minutes remaining. Uh, I don't want to be holding until expiration, you know, because anything can happen. I want to, you, the whole point of this game is to get green and then you bank it. Get green, bank it over and over. It's so freaking easy to get green. If you've been trading for a while, you know this. It's so freaking easy to get green. What's hard, though, is having the emotional discipline to, to uh, uh, keep it. <laughs> Uh, take the green. Stop being so freaking greedy. And especially when you get closer to expiration, take the green. I'm close to honestly just taking it right now. Um, but I, I do believe this is a bank. I mean, this is such a great trade that I want to make sure that I'm making enough profit on all my winners to cover any losses that I, uh, that I take throughout the day. Okay. So I'm going to hold this just for a little bit longer. Show you the chart here really quick. You can see the great uh, supply zone that I sold right there. And then of course we got the four hour uh, longer term supply zone as well. Um, go back. So um, I'll, I'll, take, I'll take profit on this here in just a, just a sec. You can see my take profit order. As you can see, I sold at 45, it's sitting at 15. I have a TP order in, in here at 10. And you can call this phony uh, all you want, but something that you got to be chanting to yourself as you're trading, right? Because trading is all emotional. These charts are so freaking simple. You just got to control your emotions, right? One of the things I used to say is like, you know, get green, bank it, get green, bank it, get green, bank it, right? And I just ingrained that in my head, get green, bank it, get green, bank it, right? I said it so many freaking times because your job, this is all your job is, is to get green, and then bank it. That's all your job is. Because it's so easy to get green in this game. What's hard is your emotional discipline to take the green. Take it. There's 18 minutes left. There's just too much risk to be holding for only $10, right? I sold at 45 and I take profit at 10. There's too much risk to be holding for that long. So my take profit's just about to be taken out. Show you the chart really quick. You can see how the, uh, the supply zone held like absolute perfection. I mean, I don't know how much better you can get this. So 1475, I got my working order out there to take profit at 10. You can actually see my working orders right there. Uh, you see it says 110, that's me. So you're actually trading against other people. So I just need somebody to come in and take that order from me. And uh, so it looks like it's just hovering around. Uh, pause real quick. We're getting closer, about three bucks. Um, and, and more than likely, this will be a full profit winner, but that's not what this game is. This game is get green and bank it. And so trying to trying to catch this live so just so you can see it. Um, this is what you have to be. This is exactly how you need to be recording yourself trading as well. Uh, every single day, show the bird's eye view context, show your entry. What are you selling? What are you buying? Where's your TP? All that stuff. So my TP order just got filled, and so pretty good stuff. Um, 
Again, I don't, uh, let me go back here. So there it was, Supply Zone. I mean, man, this is so freaking fun. You gotta make sure you're recording yourself. I'm here to help you. Show me what you're doing. Get green and bank it. Uh, remember that chant, um, sell at the highs, buy at the lows, get out the money, take profits. Pretty good stuff. Message me or Ryan Smith if you have any questions.